Here we are, severe MMA at Bama 25, arguably the greatest card in UK history in the last few years. We're alongside Jai Herbert. Happy belated birthday. Thank you very much. And a Steve. huge win over yes. an incredibly tough end tough game, guy, yeah. Tony Morgan. Yeah. Talk us through the fight from your perspective. Um, yeah, we come out, touch gloves. I was uh, basically, Tony was moving around a lot, I was moving about a lot. Footwork, faint, and I tried to get my jab going, got that going. And I sort of noticed he was backing up, moving um, side to side, laterally, laterally. And um, he was looking for single shots. So I was, I was watching that, I was watching the counter. I just thought I'd put him on the back, back foot, started letting my kicks go, punches. Tried to, I tried to work the body because I knew he was coming down from welterweight. So I thought I'd work the body more. So I, got, I got to ask the question because a lot of that fight was Tony Morgan with his back to the cage or within a foot of the cage trying to circle off. Was that, was that game plan, keep him, keep him moving backwards all the time? Well, the, the game plan was um, my coach thought he, thought he thought he was going to die. He thought he'd back up, look for the single shot, the single counter. So we worked coming in, throwing our, throwing our shots and then getting out of range, in and out of range. So that's what, that's what happened. He landed, a, he landed a couple in the first that looked, like, that looked like they hurt. You know, was there some power sting behind it? Did you have to bite down on the gum shield? Yeah, he caught me with a couple of shots. Just, um, he caught me with a straight right, right in that, but I, seen t I tend to recover. I recovered really well. I thought, oh, that was a good shot, but it wasn't like days or anything. He caught me with a banging left hook. Fucking jaw's killing me now. <laughs> uh, proper. Uh, yeah, he had some really good shots. At the end of the round, he caught, he caught me. I think he thought he hurt me, but I was just getting out of range. But as I was getting out of range, I just was going straight back. I was going backwards in a straight line so we carried on coming forward which really I should have circled off but first round I think, the fir you learned, I think the first round uh, yeah. again uh, arguably it was a clear cut 10-9 first round for yourself yeah. second round was a different animal though it just looked like it just looked like you, you, you went up another couple of gears and he couldn't kind of catch up with you. Is, is that what it felt like in there? Uh, I went back to the corner and, and my coach was telling me don't be afraid to get in the clinch, get inside with him, throw the elbows and knees and he, he said before, John says uh, if you do what you want to do, if you want to take him down, if you want to clinch up with him, do it like so. I got in there, second round, clinched him up through a couple of elbows, he was hurt with you. And then next thing you know, he was I couldn't he was covering his head well and I thought, oh, you know, I'm gonna put him on a put him on a mat and throw some shots, got him on a mat. I thought I'd just uh, I'd tap him out. So we said, yeah, you know, you looked for the rear naked, the, you had to readjust once and then that tap came quick. What are you most uh, other than the crank more more it was uh, more crank, to be honest. I said rear naked choke, yeah. but I had it over his chin. Uh, he tapped out. I knew he was going to tap. Tap. I could feel it. You know, this was a this was a this is a big fight between two of and I keep saying two two very very solid UK prospects at the weight class. And you've come f through in spades. I know you're respectful. I know you're not going to call any. But, but surely you're going to be watching that Lonsdale title fight, thinking yeah, now maybe I'm a fight or two only a fight yeah. or two away from there. Most definitely, I'll be watching that later on the, on the world title and everything. I think I am a fight or two away from that that belt. To be honest, you know, again, I'm not asking you. Talk shit, but is there anybody that makes sense as a next step? Is there I'm some? Not, I'm not sure, to be honest. I am. Um, I think now. I think it's time I stepped up a bit now. Get someone who's not a bit known. Do you think, John? Any time to step up a bit yeah. now, like, I think, and then ch try to go from there. You know, give it my best. Wow, yeah, performances like this, uh, we, we can take nothing away from Tony Morgan. Anybody yeah, in UK totally MMA, brilliant. they know that this kid's going to have a future. It's just yours is coming a little bit quicker. Jai, congratulations.